back with Mass Effect 2, the legendary edition modded. Not everything yet, we get those two modded badasses here. Garrus doesn't have his modded face yet, that's the biggest problem I have. After I recruit him, he will have that. But yeah. You're kicking ass, Shepard. They barely touched me. And we got Jareth in the process. I've been hunting that little bastard for months. Why were you after him? He's been shipping tainted Ezo all over Citadel space. Half the goods I seized back at CSEC came from his team here on Omega. I took out a big shipment a while back and killed his top lieutenant in the process. Not surprised he decided to work with the other mercs after that. We've still got Blood Pack and Blue Suns left. Think we can make a break for it? Maybe. Let's see what they're up to. They've reinforced the other side, heavily, but they're not coming over the bridge yet. What are they waiting for? What the oh, I hate this part. Damn it. They breached the lower level. Well, they had to use their brains eventually. You'd better get down there, Shepard. I'll keep the bridge clear. I didn't come all this way to let you die. We'll split up two and two. Keep one of my team here. You sure? Who knows what you'll find down there? Zaid, stay with Gerus. Keep him alive. Roger that. Thanks, Shepard. You better get going. How do I get to the basement? Go down a level. The basement door is on the west side of the main room behind the stairs. I'll radio directions if you need help, but you've got to get down there quick. Good luck. Behind the dead corpses. And behind the dead corpses. Oopsie. Can I finally find the stairs? That's not the right stairs. Oh, that's the right way. Good. This part is actually quite difficult. Ah, uh, I believe it was kind of weird. But we're gonna get through it. The medical. Okay, wait. I can choose weapons here. Grenade launcher, arc projector. I don't know what that is. Not the right part to try. Ah, safe. I'm gonna save. Safety. Get to the console and close that shutter before they can get through. Commencing shutdown. <clears throat> shutter secured. Okay. There's two more shutters. Get them closed fast. Oof. There's a little muddy gel here. No shields. Not the right button. Damn it. Flamethrower, dude. Oh, Flamethrower, dude. I hope I got a good save. Oof. He goes. <clears throat> Damn it. 
What the hell is wrong with this flamethrower, dude? Oh god, damn. Front just gonna explode in my face. Singularity, I'll better I'll hold them off as soon as I get there. Commencing shutdown. Whoop it. Singularity is already gone. There we go. That's what I like to see. Commencing shutdown. Damn it. Kill that thing. Get that shutter closed. We can't fight them on two fronts. It's close. Secured. Ha 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 ha. Where's Miranda? I believe it's not Taking too bad. Some fire, Shepard. Time to get those damn shutters open. If I don't have say by side or second squad mate credits, I should have. Yep. <laughs> Damn you! Let me down. Have right hand advantage. I'm gonna do. Apparently. Is still alive here. You, that's bad. Damn it, I can't. Whip it. Nope, 
let's just use heavy gun. I've got no shield. Damn it. Got no armor. That he didn't use it. He didn't use it. Fuck me. Oh. Oh, he didn't use it. Better be some ammo somewhere here. There's not. Good job. Good job. Good job. I got oh. it. Gotcha. <laughs> That's so difficult to jump down. To wait. What's that sound? Away. I'm going to need some help soon. They're getting more aggressive. Shield to fail. Kurgan charging. Is he? Damn it. Commencing shut down. That's not good. Commencing shutdown. Construction detected. Damn you. the doors oh so much trouble Arrgh, rip them to shreds watch my back i'll deal with archangel oh god i don't need to run there manually You fool. Enemy charging. Coming in close. <laughs> Let's try this. That was a waste. That was a waste of ammo. Now let's finish you off. <laughs> let's take more in trouble. No that pistol can kick some ass. Where is the big goddamn Krogan? Up here. Oh boy. Found that one. Fly. You fly, hopefully too. No, he eats it. 
Cossif. Whoa. No, he flies. Whew. Is there actually someone alive? No, that's not good. Just good. Mm. Tough bastards, but I've seen worse. And we mm. took out Garm and his blood pack. This day just gets better and better. He was one tough son of a bitch. You fought with him before? Yeah, we tangled once. Caught him alone, none of his gang, to help him. He still couldn't take him out. I've never seen a Krogan regen that fast. He's a freak of nature. He just kept at it until his Vorcha showed up. It was close, but I had to let him go. Not this time. Only the Blue Suns are left. I say we take our chances and fight our way out. I think you're right. Tarek's got the toughest group, but nothing we haven't faced before. Besides, he won't be expecting us to meet him head on and... Heads up! Damn it, team. I thought I took that thing out already. They fixed it, but not completely. I made sure of that. Did They're I get that, dude? Through. Watch your back, Shepard. Can I please target that fair person? That didn't work. Shameful still here. Yep, she's still there. Um, whoop him. That's the girl we talked to. Damn, I died there. I didn't expect that. I need to look at my health bar. They fixed oh. it, but not completely. I made sure of that. I need to shoot better. Whoops. Watch your back. There we go. No, it's not ready yet. Get through my shield! What left to worry about? She's still alive now, she ain't. Oh damn, did the gun shit just shoot him? No, this one. The repelling down the side wall, ground floor. They reached the rear Get stair. To cover up, you fool. That one hit. Cost. Oh, this. He goes. I'm <clears throat> right. Won't hit him. Oh, I actually hit him. Unbelievable. And he's gonna walk right into that. Perfect. Actually, a good goddamn singularity. Who would have thought? Not me. And not it yet. Never saw me coming. No. Gunship time. Send people down. Oh. 
Oh, I wish it would flew out of the window. What is the gunship doing this? Everything on to the gunship team. Good, good throw, good throw. My throws are the weakest. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. This will put him down. Now let's finish you off. Get it, cover. I don't know why he doesn't do that automatically. Another one. No. No. It's not what I wanted. <laughs> uh. I'm a little bit too close to the gunship for my liking. But it's almost done. He goes. It's down. Way down it goes. Archie. He dead. Even before the suicide mission. <laughs> Harris. <laughs> We're getting you out of here, Garrus. Just hold on. Radio Joker, make sure they're ready for us. He's not gonna oh. make it. I hope he's very rot face this time. Not his just vanilla face, his modded face. Level up, mission summary, death damage, good. Yeah, I believe I got a trophy. <laughs> oh, that a tie out, both of us. Done what we could for Garrus, but he took a bad hit. The docs corrected with surgical procedures and some cybernetics. Best we can tell, he'll have full functionality, but. Shepard. Oh. <laughs> Tough son of a bitch. Didn't think he'd be up yet. Nobody would give me a mirror. How bad is it? They gave you a new face, dude. Looks good. They did what they could, but you're gonna have some scars. I'm sorry. Ah, uh, probably for the best. Everyone was always ignoring you and hitting on me. Time for you to get a fair shot at it. God damn it, Jacob. Put some arm on. Frankly, I'm more worried about you. I've heard bad things about Cerberus these past few years. The Collectors are wiping out human colonies, Garrus. Nobody else cares enough to stop it. I can't argue with that. Hard to believe the Council is letting the attacks go unanswered, though. Damn politicians. I'm fit for duty whenever you need me, Shepard. I'll settle in and see what I can do with the forward batteries. Good. Good. Guess I could actually talk to the crew for a while. And then go back for Morden. Morden doesn't have any mods. He didn't give him any. What's up, Jacob? Commander, there hasn't been time to really settle in and take stock. I want to say that working with you is a great opportunity to do something that matters. It's a privilege to serve on the Normandy, Commander. Let's talk about all workouts. You're here because you're Cerberus. Don't expect special treatment. Understood. But not everyone in the group is hardline. I'm an employee because I believe in their current direction. Doesn't mean I don't have concerns about their past actions. Or some of yours. You watch me, I'll watch you. That suits you? What has Cerberus done to make you nervous? A lot. They've been called terrorists, and with good reason. Doubt you can find a more checkered past. But if the Collector threat is real, and we do something about it, Cerberus will be remembered differently. Or we'll all be tried and executed. Can't count on people thinking about it as hard as I have. If you follow orders and keep to yourself, we'll have no problems. Fair enough, Commander. Let me know if you need anything. Renegades. What do I have weapon wise? Arc projector. I don't know you. You're a I can I can switch out anything here. Talk to Edith, and that's the last thing I want. 
Damn it, I can't sprint off and get dead. Not like that. Okay, let's talk to the crew a bit. Just the important part. Miranda and Garris. I'm not here to talk. I'm here to prepare ourselves a bloody suicide mission. And a more decent one. After that. But blood will flow. Commander, what can I do for you? She's in her armor. I don't like that. Anything I should know regarding the Normandy? The crew's working well, and the ship appears to be performing to specifications. What exactly are your duties, aside from keeping an eye on me? I'm the elusive man's agent. You're his most important asset. My job is to make sure you succeed. Aside from that, I send regular reports to the elusive man, updating our status. Do you have a minute, Miranda? No doubt you've got a lot of questions. Cerberus isn't as evil as most people believe. If I can help allay any of your concerns, I'd be happy to do so. So, what would you like to know? What can you tell me about the elusive man? Not much that you don't already know. Even I don't have access to most of his background. And you've seen more of him than most ever do. It's rare for him to become directly involved in missions, but you're something special. Whatever else people might say about him, I can assure you he's got humanity's best interests at heart. That includes you and me. How can you be sure of that if you know so little about him? I didn't get to where I am without knowing how to gauge people's motives and ambitions. Even from brief encounters. He's no saint, and he'd be the first to admit it. But he is committed. Humanity couldn't have a better advocate. Mm-hmm. Right. So that's me, you mean. What kind of resources does Cerberus have? We're very well funded, though I doubt anyone other than the elusive man knows exactly how well. But our resources aren't unlimited. Reviving you and rebuilding the Normandy was a significant investment. And a significant risk. We're all hoping you can do the impossible, Shepard. No pressure. Sure. Are you military or political? Or both? Cerberus has several divisions. Political, military, scientific. But we're all working towards the same goal. We keep our ranks and structure similar to the Alliance. A lot of our recruits started there, but not all Cerberus operations use the same protocols. We try not to get bogged down in bureaucracy or formality. I know what we're doing here, but what's Cerberus's long-term goal? The advancement of the human race. Nothing more, nothing less. The Salarians have the Special Tasks Group. The Asari have their legendary commandos for stealth and recon operations. Cerberus is humanity's answer to those organizations. That sounds so fancy. But those organizations are regulated by governments. Who keeps Cerberus in check? Nobody. We're privately funded and our backers trust the elusive man to make the right decisions. But he's very clear about our goals. Protect humanity and serve its advancement. That's not clear at all, actually. Tell me about yourself, Miranda. Oh, I guess that's fair. I've spent the last two years learning everything there is to know about you. Well, you should probably know that I've had extensive genetic modification. Not my decision. But I make the most of it. It's one of the reasons the elusive man handpicked me. I'm very good at just about anything I choose to do. What level of genetic modification are we talking about? That's very thorough. Physically, I'm superior in many ways. I heal quickly and I'll likely live half again as long as the average human. My biotic abilities are also very advanced. For a human. Add to that some of the best training and education money can buy and... Well, it's pretty impressive, really. Sounds like you were designed to be perfect. Maybe, but I'm not. I'm still human, Shepard. I make mistakes like everyone else. And when I do, the consequences are severe. Everyone expects a lot from someone with my... abilities. You certainly don't lack for confidence. It's just a fact. My reflexes, my strength, even my looks, they're all designed to give me an edge. No point in hiding from it. It's the reason I'm trusted to oversee the most dangerous, risky, and technically demanding operations Cerberus undertakes. And it's why I was assigned to you. It's my job to make sure you succeed, Shepard. Thanks for the information, Miranda. I'll talk to you later. Of course, Commander. Whatever you need. Oh, I need another button to run. Chef surprise hey. again. Come on, Rupert. I'm sorry, Princess. Filet mignon and caviar coming right up. Let me just get out my doilies. That'd be real nice, Mr. Gardner. Commander Shepard, the hero of the Citadel, you did humanity proud that day. 
Miss Sergeant Rupert Gardner here. How can I be of service? You have everything you need. I make do. But have you ever tried to prepare a decent meal with military provisions? I'm good, but I'm no miracle worker. Taking down the collectors is going to be rough business. The crew deserves a few fine meals before they throw themselves into the fire. What do you need? If I had some quality ingredients... Oh, shit. You've got more to worry about than grocery shopping on the Citadel. Forget I mentioned it. I have more important things to do. Understood. If these provisions just happen to fall into your lap, I'd greatly appreciate you bringing them on back. Anything else you'd like to talk about? The light just changed. I won't take any more of your time. Back to work. Back to work. I don't want to talk to everybody. That's too much talking time. I need more action time so I can die. Oh yeah. Shepard, need me for something? What can you tell me about the Normandy's armaments? Looks like Cerberus upgraded what the ship carried before. Should have a bit more kick. I still don't like our chances against a collector ship, though. Not unless we upgrade the guns. Have the Cerberus crewmen given you any trouble? I think being part of the team that took down Saren got me some points. Everyone I talked to was polite, anyway. Don't worry, Commander. We're all working together. Have you got a minute? Sure. Just checking the weapon systems. You can never be too careful. I thought I'd seen every weapon in the galaxy in our fight against Saren. Mercenary work showed me otherwise. And now Cerberus rebuilds the Normandy with a few upgrades to boot. I wish we'd joined up with them sooner. Oh, you don't mean that. I'm pleased to see that you're getting along with the new crew. They're as friendly to me as people from a group like Cerberus can be. And they've got you vouching for them. I can't exactly doubt your judgment. Not after I got my own squad killed. What did your merc squad do? It didn't sound like you were available for hire. You saw Omega. It was full of thugs kicking the helpless. I formed my team to kick back. We weren't mercenaries. At least nobody was paying us. We made money by taking down slavers, pirates, or gangs that went too far. It doesn't sound like you made any friends with the gangs. I got three separate merc bands to work together to take me down. My manager at CSEC would be impressed. It was simple. We'd hit their shipments, disrupt activities, get under their skin, make them angry. They'd come charging right into our well-prepared kill zone, crossfire and snipers, clean and surgical. They never stood a chance. It sounds like you were just another gang. Then I'm saying it wrong. We didn't shake anyone down. No civilian casualties. That was our rule. Every member of my team had lost someone to Omega's gangs. We weren't out to get rich. We were out to make those bastards think twice before murdering someone in the street. How'd you end up fighting mercenaries here on Omega? After the Normandy was destroyed, most of us went our separate ways. CSEC asked me back, but I turned them down. Omega was filled with criminals nobody else could touch. And there was no red tape to slow me down. It was a perfect fit. People here needed someone to believe in. Someone to stand up to the local thugs. That explains how you started. How'd you end up with a squad? Not too different from how you formed your squad to fight Saren, actually. You prove that you get things done, and people join up. Mercs who wanted to atone. Security consultants tired of playing by the rules, I gave them hope. And now they're dead. Shows what I know. Tell me about your squad. There were 12 of us, including me. Former military operatives, CSEC agents, the usual. Had a Salarian explosives expert. Pretty sure he'd spent time in the special tasks group. My tech expert was a Batarian, believe it or not. Not the friendliest guy, but he could hack any system ever built. How do those mercenary gangs take down your team? It was my own damn fault. One of my people betrayed me. A Turian named Sidonis. He drew me away just before the mercs attacked my squad. Then he disappeared. Everyone except me is dead because of him. And because I didn't see it coming. Are you sure it was a betrayal? Maybe they took Sidonis out first. No. I put out feelers with some old contacts. 
He booked transport off Omega just before the attack. He also cleared out his private accounts before he left. He sold me out and ran. I'm not sure I understand. What happened exactly? Sedonis asked for my help on a job. When I got to the meeting point, nobody was there. By the time I got back to our hideout, the mercs had killed all but two of my squad. And they didn't last long. Do you know where Sedonis is now? No. His trail vanishes after he leaves Omega, but I'll keep hunting. I lost my whole team except for Sedonis. One day I'll find him and correct that. Thanks for coming by, Shepard. I've got some things to take care of. Doesn't quite fit his voice, the new face, but it looks badass. Ah, oh, Chakwa, don't care. Let's get down to the mission screen. I'm probably going to get more in. But I also want to do the missions where I can get Legion and Samara early. Commander, you've received a new message at your private terminal. There. What is it? Okay, yeah, sure. I probably won't even read any of those. Who reads? Read it for me. Okay, let's see if I can... Crash side, we will do that too. Convict. Best to explore normally crash side, investigate project overlord. Am I? Yeah, I'm probably gonna do mods. Recruit the master thief, recruit overlord. Obsade, firewalker. Hmm. Hmm. Ah, uh, talk. I don't have a different armor yet, I believe. Select. Uh, can I skip? I can skip. Good. We saw that already. You. Sarkul appearance. Let's go with this bad boy armor. I will take Tim. I will put her in the casuals again. And Saeed with the code. That's my squad for here. I don't have any more points. I will probably go with warp first. Say hold away concussive shot. And one disrupt the ammo. Yeah. That armor is a little bit too pink for him. Back. How's my team looking? Warnings about the slums where Dr. Morton Solis runs the clinic. Anticipate resistance at the transport station. I have also run searches for reports on Archangel. The various mercenary groups appear to believe that he is dead. Works for me. Okay. I want to go shopping first, though. Apartment Marketplace. The attack on the What's human that? colony of Freedom's Progress has generated a swift but confused response. Aid vessels have been sent, but it is not clear whether there are survivors. The Council offered its sympathy, but regretted that it could not become involved in a purely human matter. The is and is not. Let's hope so. Light on galactic purity. That's where that mission starts. You. And you, human, and you. That's a crowd, man. Protheans cast off the lesser races, the crowd, the Vorja, and the humans. And so they dwell in the universe. Tentatively excited. Welcome, human. What can I get for you? What kinds of things do you sell here? Friendly, salvaged parts. All kinds. Mostly legitimate. With pride. My prices are the lowest anywhere on the station. You won't find salvage cheaper than mine. I have things to do. Courteously, have a fine day. There's Take a quest look here. Later, later. I might have something here for humans. Not much. Ah, uh, it's too low. Too low. You'll be back. I will wait. I will wait. Council has pledged 
Mr. Gabon, we not kill anyone today. I don't know a Captain Gabon. Why would I tell him anything? Not trust you. Tell Gabon we know his tricks. We not kill anyone today. There seem to be a lot of Vorcha on Omega. Go away. Talk too much. Gabon's box get no more. We leave. Good talking to you. No more talk. We know Gabon's tricks. We leave. That's... Walking around in this place makes me sick. People still dying. The strong still exploiting the weak. Nothing I did here even made a dent in this. Herod has something for everyone. He also sold me this spice rack shaped like a mining scanner. That's great! Hello there. Might I interest you in some salvage tech? Every credit goes toward a ticket to get me off this forsaken rock. <laughs> No one in their right mind would pay these prices for salvaged parts. I know. That's crippling my sales. Drop your prices and I'll consider buying. Otherwise, I'll keep walking. You're right. I'll give you whatever you like for the original price. And if this gets back to Harrod, I'll deal with it then. What brought a nice kid like you to Omega? My pilgrimage. What money I had got stolen within a few days, so I decided to sell salvaged parts. You can see how that turned out. Harrod's forcing me to sell high, and I can't even afford a ticket off this station. Why does Harrod control your prices? Harrod made me swear not to undercut him, no matter what. He was here first, so it's his right. But no one will buy from me when he's so much cheaper. I can't save enough money for a ticket off the station. I could go talk to Harrod for you. Get him to ease up. I won't stop you. If you can convince him to lay off, then maybe I'll get off this station after all. His shop's up the ramp, near where Marsh sells his goods. Anything you can do will be much appreciated. I have to go. Please check with my kiosk to see what I have for sale. And thank you. Nope, I'll talk to the dude first unless I you know, get a quest. What is down this? Oh, up this. Do, 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 do. Am I in the right place still? Yes. Can I give him that answer yet? I might have something here for humans. Not much. You might snare a few tourists with these prices, but I'm not giving you a single credit. Sure, you can find things cheaper if you're willing to risk the black market. Well, you and I could do business if you just charge what this crap is worth. Fine. I'll give you the uppity human discount. And that's all you're getting. Ah, oh, the uppity human discount. Ah, so, ba ba ba, increase the storm speed. Boy, what the hell? Model don't need it. Weapon upgrade. Sniper rifles. Alien magazine. That. Looks like crap. Oh. That's not worth it. I'll buy it. But he's wasting his time. The plague is the answer. Tentatively excited. Welcome, human. What can I get for you? I understand you have an arrangement with the quarian over there. Suspicious? Of course. A businessman must enter certain agreements in order to stay in business. Accusatory. I don't understand how it is any concern of yours. If you're worried about competition, why not just buy out his store? Intrigued. I had not considered that before. My fellow merchants on Omega are not known for being easy to shut down. A weak, homesick kid like that shouldn't be a problem for a man like you. Devilishly excited. I have plans to expand. On your advice, I will conquer the quarry and child. <laughs> Grateful right. to thank you for your counsel. I offer you a discount at all of my stores. I have things to do. Courteously, have a fine day. Take a look at my kiosk if you want to buy anything. Visor. Nope. That looks like trash. Heck module. 
what was the time limit for hack? Damn, I should buy that. So, oh, holy hell. Oh, I wish I would have seen that earlier. What are you? Oh, God. Aleko, a graduate of the controversial biotic acclimation and temperance training project, sacrificed his life to help stop Saren on Vermeer. What is this even? Is it a big gun? Anyways, we're buying it. Oh, okay. I already bought too much. That's cool though, Kermizama. There's the child. He gone. Heavy weapon ammo, heavy skin wave. Oh boy, there's so much shotgun, won't use that. We have plasma shotgun. Mm. Can I even play shotguns? Jesus. I shouldn't go shopping, I want to do. This should come in handy. I'm gonna be so broke. Mad talk. Yep, yeah, I'm gonna be so broke. No, no shotguns. Where the hell am I? No, got it. I need to go to the bar. But not me. No, no, we're pretty much done. Uh, not quite. What else can I do here? I was shopping and salvage afterlife VFP. Did I? I only get a drink. Let's get a drink first. Want to actually take Miranda with me for the drinking thing? Has completed its 20 colony victory cruise. Council members of the Bro squad. I'm going into the club now. Okay, let's go. I'm going into the club now. I'm lost in such a small station. Okay, let's get us a drink. Oh, let's enjoy the show first. <laughs> yeah. Tip! No way. Let's go. We don't spend any money here. Oh, she looks pissed at us for not tipping. Oopsie. No, I'm not dancing. We're getting a drink, though. Oh, wait. Nothing? We only had one chance for the drink? Really? Oh, damn it. I missed my opportunity. Ah. Oh. Disappointed. Today we interview Counselor Anderson. The tireless former soldier has put down his guns to build bridges with numerous trade treaties. Job. Aria has work for you. You're interested. I'll talk to her. What do you need? Um. This data pad was on one of the mercs that was after Archangel. They were coming for you next. Let me see. Interesting. Would someone like to tell me how this information slipped the net? I'll, I'll look into it. Thanks for the heads up, Shepard. Looks like I'll have to do a little cleaning in my organization. That's all. Thanks. Maybe I'll come back later. You do that. Experience. Yay. Nothing about Archangel. I'm talking. I want to talk. Talk to Arya. I get a drink here. That's not the right part, and I do. Ah, guess we're gonna do a sober let's play. 
Oh, he looks pissed too. I knew a bar out on the front that looked like this. Me and some friends got stupid one night. Long story short, tempers flared, followed by pistols. We all got out, except my buddy Nark. We got this narco. Sounds like a narcissist. Sort of a narcissist. Uh, narcissist. Yep, yeah, that's the right word. Oh, that's Gavorn. Captain Gavorn, head of the Vorchet Task Force. Got something to report? What's your job here exactly? Keep the Vorcha in line. Keep them out of Arya's sight. That's about it. There's an awful lot of Vorcha here. What are they planning? Vorcha? Plan? <laughs> They're a pestilence, nothing more. If they started planning, we'd all be in big trouble. I'll just be going. Keep moving. Oh, certainly, uh, that's not a cool story. Oh. So, Arya expecting you. We're pretty much done here. We're just gonna stand right in front of the door towards the next quest. Then I can relook if I find a mod for Moonin that's slightly better than the last ones I've seen. Which were trash. Trash. Can save over there. Um, exit. God damn game. Rip. Peace out.